So can you like uh, give us a brief background on like where you came from and uh, how did you end up in Yes Find Out? <laughs> I'm from I'm Nico, I'm from Bacolod City. Mm-hmm. So two years ago, two or three years ago, something <laughs> so, ganun time, um, pandemic na eh. mm-hmm. Mm. Um, I was scouted mm. on social media. Right. Then, I became a part of the team. I did regular work before. Mm. Uh, national TV show. Siya. So, I was TV5. And after that, I became a solo artist muna ako for a while. Mm-hmm. Then, uh, I became a top class mm. last year. So, um, I was able to do it. It was a P-pop reality show. Survival show. Siya. So, dun ko nakilala si Brian, RZ, mm-hmm. and Jeff sa Top Class, which is si Eli naman. Si Eli is kasama ko, isa sa mga singtower ng singtower. Mm-hmm. So, last, yung apat sa kanila is tower ko na. Oh, yung isa ko talaga na, hindi ka na. Hindi ko na. Pero si Josh, ano, mamaya na lang. So, yun yung story ko. All right. And how about you? Oh, um, I started my career in Manila. Po. I'm originally po from Las Piñas City, but I technically I'd say I grew up in Cagayan de Oro. Po. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm Visaya by heart, talaga. Mm-hmm. And um, I started my singing career po in 2018 when I competed in the Clash. Po. Mm-hmm. I joined the Clash in 2018, and then I po, my career started there. And then that's I, why you look so familiar. Yeah, so, okay. I, I probably have seen you po mm-hmm. before the po, during the press conference for the mm-hmm. Clash and um, Studio Seven. Mm-hmm. I was able to participate there. Mm-hmm. And um, uh, 2019, I signed with Cornerstone. And um, you know, it was a few years po, of being a solo artist. And mm-hmm. I was redirected. I love that part. Redirected to being in Yes, My Love. And ayun, actually, kami naman po ni Nico, actually, we're the first two uh, members na nag-meet po talaga for Yes, My Love. So, mm-hmm. ayun yung parang first meeting namin po Nico, it was him that I, that I met first. And then, so that's Kala ko yung last natin. Hindi! Hindi yung last first yun. Ayun, first of many. And um, ayun po, uh, that's how I started my career. Alright, how are you? Hello po, I'm R.C. Condor and I'm from Sydney. And mm. yeah, I'm just a normal student. That's how class came and he talks a lot. I don't know. 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 Yeah, parang destiny. <laughs> yeah. And you? Yeah, speaking of destiny, uh, way back at the sixth dinner, I scout ko and then actually for modeling yun, but mm-hmm. I ended up sa performing then. Mm-hmm. And like, oh, gusto talaga nag open up for artists ng corners ng destiny yung uh, way back at the sixth dinner pa yun sa so, perform from mga sa uh, kung saan part ng Pilipinas and then uh, last year. Yeah, so na uha ako for a pop boy group search uh I cornish on it and then mm-hmm. naman in a redirection as a cornish on parang po. So um, ever since parang destined po ako na kung dun dali sa company na to and ever happens for really uh, have series. Do you think you're more of a dancer or a singer? Uh, I'm more of a singer. Mm-hmm. Alright. And you, sir? Hello, I'm Ile Padilla. I'm from Cebu. So, uh, before I was an influencer, and then mm-hmm. uh, I was also a single, which is now something I'm doing. So, I was a singer. 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 I was a 
Also, nag-acting din po ako. Mm-hmm. Ayun. 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 Wow. That uh, involves like handcrafting, so that's my life there. But I did sing and do performing before. Also, like I've been to South Korea with a intercultural event that mm-hmm. I, I participated. I participated with, and um, I also graduated in film. Mm-hmm. And after filming, I didn't push the college mm-hmm. since like ano nag nag decide talaga na. I would want to focus my in my performing. Mm-hmm. So I tried all the things there in the industries, entertainment, and also acting. But medyo nag ano talaga nag direct talaga sa for me. Mm-hmm. Then during the pandemic, a door opened for me during the top class, mm-hmm. being one of the trainees. Tapos um, actually I'm also the winners in top class. So, mm-hmm. Because of that, I'm even I I I appear in yes. So, <laughs> uh, I'd like to ask, how happy are you that become a part of this group? I'm very happy na parang I can't describe the feeling that I have. Mm-hmm. Like, even right now, I, I really want to live my day. Mm-hmm. Like, I just want to live my my life on a daily basis. But like, I, I'm, I'm more into fun of what's the present. So, mm-hmm. Whatever is the people, yung mga people or like, like sila po na encounter ko, they're like the the, the reason of my happiness. Like it's more so of a fun experience in my daily life. So mm. that's what matters to me the most. Mm, okay. And about you? Ah, uh, ako naman actually before I don't dance and mm. like actually parang nagulat naman din ako bilang uh, nandito na ako sa group and then. Mm-hmm. Dito na ako natutong mag-dance, kumanta, so nag-perform. And then yun, very happy kasi we're... Actually, sila yun din talaga yung rason kung bakit ako nag-push. Wow. <laughs> you crazy. He's <laughs> serious. Uh, congratulations. Um, and how about you? Um, now that you're part of Fana, what have you learned so far in being part of this group? <laughs> Details. Teamwork really is teamwork. Um, mm-hmm. uh, I think you know, about this, my love is we complement each other in ways. Na parang kasi hindi po rin talaga dancing wasn't my strongest suit, and the mm-hmm. boys really helped me out in doing that. And just as much as they're helping me out, I try to uh, convey naman sa kanila kung ano pong nalalaman ko sa pagkakto my kids. And um, we're just kaya that's really what makes our group work. Until now, we just love what we do. Today. Um, and uh, the the thing that I learned the most, po talaga, is yung mutual respect, not just with each other but with the people around us. Kaya makalat makasalimuha po na. I think beyond love, uh, no pun intended. Beyond love, I think <laughs> respect is po kahit saan 
to be within your group mates, within your colleagues, within your co-workers. So I, I think everything prospers from respect and can lead to love, it can mm -hmm. lead to friendship. And I, I think it's the only thing that I really need really to And uh, can I ask you, since you're a leader per se, does that make it a heavier job, you think? For me, it's not. Because actually, the leader of the world is for formality, actually. Mm, okay. But what we do is um, very collaborative with the yes, but, uh, like the management of our good leader, the handler. So every boys, they want to make a decision before they mm. make a decision. Go into decision. Mm. So, um, lahat ng mga ng ideas, mga songs, lyrics, music video, um, shoots. So lahat kami is part talaga ng decision making, which is ako yung taka collect naman ng ideas nila. And, mm. uh, um, lahat ng sa mga boss. Mm. And, uh, basically yun yung parang ano, which is mas kumagat sa lahat. Eh, um, yun nga alin na ulo yung ano yung gumagawa lalo ng craft. So, so, like, Pantes na po si Nico. Siya po talaga sa mga tayo dito. Si Nico talaga po yung couldn't ask for. He's just being modest po. So may mga kapatid. Hindi ko siya gano'n po sa mga 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 Si Nico po talaga yung masabi po na mga 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 kasi hindi po ito daw po. Pero no, collaborative yes, pero siya po talaga yung pass your papers na 1, 2, 3. Alright, so I heard you're from Bacolod, right? Taga DN ka mismo? Pop? Taga DN ka mismo? Ay, yung buka. Oo. Taga Mau. Mau, kuya. Eh, Mau? Oo. Pero da rin ako nagdako ka. Alayis ko. Ah. Gapulay ka ba? Ah, every three years or so. Oo. Lagi tayo. <laughs> Mao Kag, Mao Central, Mao Barrio, oh, Preho. Sa Mao, what, 45 minutes? Hmm. Hour? Around that. So, but, uh, since you're not here, do you think that you're the only one from Manila? Or like, ah! Well, you're the only one from Manila? Well, I grew up in the Philippines, but my family relocated in the game when I was in high school. So, In my heart, hometown ko po yung Cagayan. Ah, well, you. How about you? Now that parang ikaw lang yung taga Manila, do you feel bad or do you feel more? So yung mga 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 Provinces. Provinces. Mm. And, ako rin po, kahit i-prefer na po ang video, gusto ko rin mag-perform kung saan po talaga kami. Kahit sa BGC lang. Mm. <laughs> what's, what's good about Bruce? I think amongst all of us, he's adaptive. Man. Kahit saan niyo po ilagay si Brian, maguwala na paglabas niya. Mm. Kaya maguwala na paglabas niya. May mga friends niya. <laughs> oh, wow. He's super adaptive and he's literally the son for the sunshine of the group. Because it's super happy and spirit. It's good for me because I'm going to stay. Where are we going to stay? We're going to stay. We're going to stay. We're going to stay. So it's kind of an advantage to you from different places. But have you performed already in those provinces or not yet? Yes, I'm going to stay. I'm going to stay out of town and out of the country. Well, yeah. Uh, but I asked. Yeah. <laughs> 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 My air. My air. My air. My air. Yeah, but I'm super, super happy to be Okay, well, uh, since you said it, um, the Nakapapunta, but uh, of course, Singapore is like a big deal, you know? Uh, just to perform out of the country is a big deal. But to be chosen among the P pop groups in the Philippines to not just represent the country, but perform there as, you know, as a talent, per se. Ang laking, ano na yan, parang badge on your, on your group. Um, when you heard the news, what was like the first thing on your mind? It was a 
it, um, I just want to start off by saying that it, we, we want to acknowledge the voice and I that we want to acknowledge that it is a privilege first and foremost that mm -hmm. we're able to do this and that's the reason why when we received the news we really didn't want to take anything for granted but we really did prepare mm -hmm. um, like hours and hours and hours of brainstorming um, collaborating with our handler our management our music label UMG um, we, we, we wanted to make sure po, that we not only represent Yes My Love the best way possible but we're also carrying the flag of people po, because there will mm -hmm. be some Singapore uh, representatives as well and beyond anything po, because as, as a unit Yes My Love isn't necessarily the conventionally competitive group po, because mm -hmm. the, the, the name speaks for itself it's Yes My Love and just by nature po, mas love talaga yung gusto namin and we really just wanna present our best kung talaga the most important thing not even nga po para competing with others it's not hindi namin na isip in it we just really wanna give the best performance and according to Ate Casey Tandigan should always tell us na um be able to be your best self you have to prepare preparation is key and um whenever we perform before pag nagtutok po kami lagi you know we're we're excited and we're ready because we prepared enough for this and that's I think the best feeling in the world that you've prepared enough for something although well over po kami there are things that could possibly happen there still but at least we know in our hearts we know in our hearts that we prepared and um, we're just so excited we're so honored and we can't wait to just live out the stage and enjoy and do what we love to do the most which is performing what do you call your fan groups by the way? One for three. 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 Wait, um, where did you get the name Yes My Love? Who thought about it? Uh, actually, what is it? It's just love. It's like we want to spread the love. Actually, it sounds good, but... Yeah, we wanted to go for a bit of a light-hearted rap. Uh, I don't remember that. Ah, Yes, my love. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> like, As in, like, for a while, we put that in the back. We wanted to So, even submitted like 20 names. Yes, potential names. Mm. So, like, in overthinking, in reality, the root of the group is we're so lighthearted. In rehearsals, we don't take ourselves seriously. Every now and then, we go to the Like, there's no dead air that we always just We wanted to, because I think that's one of the things that we love in our lives now, since it's always fast paced. We miss the joy. We miss the. You can do both. You can do both. You can be serious at the same time. You can be lighthearted. Yeah. And I think I put on the realization that actually this one is quite different. It's different. It's polarizing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but rather than it's polarizing, most people would be like, "Serious or not? Final?" Most of the time, most of the time before the premiere, it's still the same. Every time we have a commit, we get the same thing. Do you know what? 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 Do you know why is it not going to be a chance? I don't want to take over the show, so I'm going to let Albert ask you some questions. Yeah, thank you.